Hi guys, it's Justine, but you can call me Blondie, and for today's video, I'm going to take you along with me for like a little shop with me at Target, and then I'm also going to do Walmart grocery pickup later in this video. Um, uh, basically, to start off, my little brother is coming to visit me um, in a, like a week. And so while he is here, uh, we have some plans to do some Halloween things. And I was thinking of throwing a little Halloween party. I'm not sure if we're gonna um, like have one night where we just have like a little party at home or if we are just gonna have like a bunch of different activities that we're gonna divide up between the nights that he is here. But I have a bunch of things I wanna do. I really wanna do things like carve pumpkins. We do like a and make some fall foods. Um, definitely wanna get the kids like hot chocolate and apple cider and we can maybe make pumpkin balls or like another Halloween treat and get them involved in like the baking process. And so I just think that would be a lot of fun. So um, I saw some things at Target Dollar Spot not too long ago that looked really cute for kids. And so I wanna go to Target, check out the Dollar Spot and then also maybe check out the Halloween section and just see um, what they have. And then most of the food stuff I'm gonna get at Walmart with Walmart grocery pickup. So um, I'm not gonna do that for a couple more days. That way the food is like fresh. But um, as soon as I do Walmart grocery pickup, I'll do a little haul of what I got. Um, but I wanna get the food from Walmart because it's usually cheaper at Walmart than at Target. Um, like I said, it's not a huge party. It's literally just like my little brother who's seven, my son who's seven, and then my daughter who is almost three. And so it's only gonna be three kids, but I still wanna do something you know, special and fun for them um, since Halloween is coming up. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and go to Target and do a little shop with me with you guys. Okay, so I am not very good at filming in public, but the first thing that I spotted were these candles. They have nothing to do with a little kid's party, but I just thought they were so cute. They had little lids that looked like coffee mugs. They were three bucks though for tiny little candles, so I did pass up on those. And then we finally hit the Halloween jackpot in the dollar spot section. Um, they had so many cute little things for kids. Um, the things that caught my eye the most were these like glass milk jugs um, and they had straws and lids and little uh, creatures and Halloween figures on the front. I thought they were so cute um, and I did end up picking a couple of these up. They also had a few Halloween plates which we actually have a couple of at home but I did end up picking up another one which I'll show you in just a second. I really wanted to do a painting project with the kids and so I'm so happy that we found these things that you could paint. Um, they had little uh, like houses um, that were $3 each, little stands that were a dollar each, and then they also had these face masks. I think they were face masks. They might have been like yard stakes. Um, they were a dollar each, but the yard stick slash possibly face mask things didn't come with paint and I liked that the haunted houses and the other little just stand-up decorations came with paint um, that you could use. And then this clip is like a little bit long because my son and I were debating which ones we should get for everybody. They had a bunch of different designs and stuff but we decided to go with the candy corn. And then over here I just wanted to quickly show you all the little party favor goodies that they have that you can make like party bags with or you can pass them out to trick-or-treaters. I ended up passing on this stuff because there's only three kids um, but I just thought it was really cute and thought I would share it with you guys. I also found a few baking kits and also just stuff to make fun, well fun, funfetti um, cupcakes and cookies. They had a few things, but overall, I don't think my Target was finished putting um, the baking stuff out. Either that or they got really picked over really early on into the season because they didn't have as much as they usually do. And then I just wanted to show you some of the festive drinks they had as well as some paper plates and paper and plastic cups and stuff but since I decided to get the reusable plastic plates and like glass cups from the dollar section I decided to pass up on all that stuff. Okay so here are the few things we picked up at Target. We got this 
plate. Um, like I said, we already have two. I'll show you them in a minute, but they're both dirty right now. And then we got three of these same trick or treat signs to paint. These were only a dollar. They also had like some haunted houses that were three dollars, but we went with these. I also got all three the same so that way the kids aren't fighting over um which ones they want to paint and stuff but as you guys saw they had a bunch of different designs then we got three of these little glass bottles and so we have a little witch a little frankenstein i don't know how well you guys can see in this lighting and a little pumpkin and then my son also picked these out um he saw the stickers and he wanted to get some so these are stickers, we'll do them tomorrow. So I also got these um, so we can put them on the window tomorrow and um, they're just for decoration. Hey everybody, so as promised, I'm now going to show you the stuff from my Walmart grocery pickup um, that is for our party that I'm not sure if it's gonna be like a big party yet or if we're just gonna divide a bunch of activities up. But first, these are our plates from last year that I got the kids, so now each kid can have their own you know spooky little plate and then here's the glasses they actually match the plates like pretty perfectly so there's that and then I also just wanted to share with you because I don't think I'm going to be doing any like um other Halloween videos other than this one but I wanted to tell you about my kids Halloween costumes first is just for a baby girl who will hopefully be born in October I just got her this little pumpkin hat um, and I got it off Amazon it was only a couple dollars so there's that and then mine and the other kids costumes have not come in yet but I will put pictures of them up here my son's gonna be a velociraptor from Jurassic World and my daughter's gonna be a kitty cat so I just wanted to share those I actually just placed the order last night oh and then I'm gonna be a jack-o-lantern I got like a big jack-o-lantern shirt um, that way if I'm still pregnant, it's fitting because it'll be a pumpkin and then if I'm no longer pregnant, then that's fine. I'll just be a pumpkin without the big belly. So um, I put it all in my um, Amazon storefront if you guys are interested. So that will be linked down below and definitely check it out. But first, I'm going to show you what we got at Walmart for our party. So first off, the things the kids are most excited about, we got these types of cookies. I thought of doing like an activity for them that would be more exciting like decorating cupcakes or something but honestly we're gonna be doing so much stuff while they are here visiting so I just decided to keep it simple and the kids can make these also just got a Halloween table cover a little um, purple spider web which I thought was cute then these are just snacks for like the next week um, since we'll be going out and doing touristy stuff, I just thought I would get some snacks for the kids for when we're on the road and I decided to keep it Halloween themed. So we've got some Cheez-Its, some iced apple oatmeal mini cookies, and some little monster gummy snacks. And then for drinks, I got this big thing of hot cocoa mix. We have so many marshmallows already and we have whipped cream in the fridge. So we'll have that. Then some fresh apple cider, which will probably go in those cups I just showed you with the cute little straws. And then over here, I got a bunch of stuff to make a cheese board, which I've never done before. So we have two types of crackers, some hummus, some fig jelly. And then we have four different kinds of meats. I got salami pepperoni, this fancy stuff that I don't know how to pronounce, and then just some regular old ham for the kids because I don't know if they'll like the other stuff, minus the pepperoni, they'll probably like that. Um, and then I got four different types of cheeses, this garlic and fine herb, it's like a soft cheese, this smoky bacon, some smoked gouda, and then again, just some plain cheddar cheese for the kids. We've also got hummus, some dried fruits, dried apricots, and dried cranberries. Then two types of olives, black olives and um, garlic stuffed green olives, which are super good, especially if you like garlic. And then these are the candies for trick-or-treaters that I need to hide from my family, or they will eat them before Halloween, but I wanted to get them now before they sold out because last year I remember getting them early and then I wanted to get more and then they were all sold out. So 
that is it for all of the Halloween goodies for the kids. Okay guys, so that is it for today's shop with me slash plan with me slash haul. I'll probably vlog a little bit when my family is here, especially the cheese board because I'm so excited to put that together. Um, like I said, it's my first time putting it together putting one together and yeah um i love halloween i'm so excited for this season one thing that i did want to mention is um i also want to make popcorn balls which the way that i make popcorn balls is i literally just take a rice crispy recipe and instead of using rice krispies use popcorn so it's just like butter marshmallows and popcorn um and i use the same measurements as you would a rice crispy recipe so we're also going to be making those on top of the cookies I also um, got a couple Halloween movies um, recorded for the kids because we're, we still have cable. I feel like we're the last people on earth that still have cable, but uh, I recorded Hocus Pocus, which I'm not sure they'll like, Paranorman, and Monster House. So we'll also have some like Halloween movies to go with our little Halloween party. So yeah, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.